here's a little demonstration of my LEDs using CleanVite. So first of all, here's my quad transmitter. So let's see what happens if we have uh, a battery. Tight, but okay. So first of all, you see the uh, initial, the uh, NACE32 initializing. Looks familiar, I think. I'll show you. So there's four here. There's four over there. There's one at the back. Let's go to the front, actually. First, the front lights function as warning lights. So the intention there is that that is uh, also functioning as a uh, warning. It's a cheap as uh, I'd say OSD. Go blink red if the uh, battery is empty. The feed that uh, threshold is met. So this is, uh, of course, the uh, gyro uh, giving an alarm. Let's see if you the video gives you a good view. Next is uh, I have the rear LED here, configured as, as a uh, arm switch. So when I arm my uh, transmitter, this is my arm button, it gives uh, blue. The other ones, the thing is, they uh, light up as, uh, as you move to thrust. So, even more thrust changes the color. Let me demonstrate that. So, this is a zero throttle, and then if you push throttle, it goes red and it goes yellow. This is somewhat greenish. So, these colors can be changed, but I haven't figured the set text out yet. So. And then uh, another neat feature is the uh, indicator lights. So. Right. See the right go blink, go further, it starts blink faster. And then of course there is uh, at the left. I try to go back left. So if I reverse, or if I go backwards, then uh, both lights blink. That's because uh, I've configured it such that uh, the uh, flight controller knows that these are south facing. If I would uh, have them uh, front facing, uh, light up as you go forward, push forward. So that's it. I can actually give you a small demonstration what happens if you actually fly. Feature of uh, Clean Flight. Thanks for watching.